yes, study his did. life. We're to emulate his life. Right. We're to be Christ-like, mm -hmm. and he always chose people over program. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, he totally. was doing his Father's will, mm -hmm. but it, it was it was in the context yeah. of people, mm -hmm. and he's the one who models friendship. Mm -hmm. I've had to kind of get spankings multiple times from the Holy Spirit saying, you reflect Jesus, but you aren't Jesus. Right. And I need you to get out of my way. Mm -hmm. Because wow. I will, in wow. the context of trying to keep peace, mm -hmm. I'll sometimes keep something going. And the Lord yeah. says, I, I actually didn't. wanted mm -hmm. that to end mm -hmm. because I'm gonna deal with them. Because I know you were wired so similarly with, with yeah. loyalty. I'll run and distract people mm -hmm. yeah. from, I think, the pain or the, mm -hmm. where they're supposed to hit a wall. Right. I'd run and throw myself between them yeah. and the wall for mm -hmm. thinking that's compassion. Mm -hmm. There's nothing compassionate about that. I've put myself in the place mm -hmm. of Jesus. It's mm -hmm. let me run beside you. I don't mm -hmm. need to fix. I don't need to soften whatever God's going to do. Mm -hmm. Let me just go. If you hit the wall and go splat, yeah. I'll be here a year. Or that's two later. what I remember. That I, was, I, I remember having the conversation with Nick and saying, I'm going to get off this train as painful as yeah. it is. Mm -hmm. And it, from what I can see, and God, thank God, is mm -hmm. far more infinitely more merciful right. than me, so right. I could be totally wrong. I go, but from my vantage point right, right. now, this train's gonna hit the wall. Right. Now knowing God and his graciousness, it probably won't, he'll open the wall up, right. but, you right. know. And I said, the best thing I can do is make sure I'm healthy and strong, because right. this is not keeping me healthy, right. Yeah. Right. so that I could be a first responder yeah. when mm -hmm. the train does hit the wall. I, yeah. I think maybe one of my problems was wanting peace so badly mm -hmm. that when you can't make peace, right and you can't keep it because there's others involved. Right. I took it internally. Your insides oh, yeah. literally yeah. get, oh, get yeah. messed up oh, yeah. and you get sick. Yeah. Yeah. That totally happened to yeah. me. Mm -hmm. And um, so there's people who have to have all the attention yeah. in yeah. a relationship. Yeah. What do we do about that? If it's just all about you, mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, even, even family members. I'm sure we have a lot of family oh. members that everything oh, directs yeah. my way every time you get together right. for Thanksgiving oh, yeah. and mm -hmm. Christmas and all that and that drama. Um, when, when is it healthy just to say, you know what, we need to stop this and, and, and take on the thing that I cannot, I am a peacemaker, but sometimes yeah. God has to just do yeah, it. Yeah, he's right. just got to do it. God just the, has to the, do it. The smartest thing right. I've done in a whole lake of dumb things I've done relationally, smartest thing I've done is I had a drama llama, this woman in my life who was just everything always revolved drama around llama. her. Drama oh, llama. Just, <laughs> drama llama. Drama llama. But I, and it was making me so frustrated because mm -hmm. I was like, oh, wow, back to you. Because everything was always about her, always about her, whether it was high or low. Mm -hmm. And then I just had this idea, you know what? The Bible says that when we focus on other people, um, actually we'll, we'll be doing his work. And so I invited her to go with me downtown. I volunteer in Nashville with these women who are coming out of prison and recovering. And um, it was the coolest thing to say, hey, you want to go with me? I tend to be so self-centered, and it really <laughs> helps me to go love on these women oh, who are coming out of prison. And, and she was just like, but she couldn't really say no, or she was <laughs> like a total, you know, Even narcissistic boo-boo. And so she went with me and watching, you know, she's still involved in that program. And that's, oh, I wow. now don't have enough time, but I watched that change her. Wow, and it's I like the it. Lord said, mm. Lisa, sometimes you still have to have hope yeah. for people who who in the wow, natural that's world a really look hopeless, good example. but then scoot them there. It's not all yeah. about me. I'm not right. taking her there. I'm not trying to fix her. I'm just like, maybe, maybe there's a chance she won't be so self-focused. Yeah. Hi, everybody. I hope you've enjoyed this video. There's a whole lot more. You can subscribe and let's get better together.